Regional House of Chiefs, Queen Mothers of the Oti Region, Honorable Joshua Mayena Makubu, Nana Owusu Afari, Dr. Daniel Kosina, Oti Mantem for any Ghana and the Shimamena, Mosum for Akosia, Michiamo, Miss Damasipi, Sema Soma sending me about you do something Pensui. As I always say, the Oti Region is a hidden gem, and tonight, we are going to discover some of Ghana's best kept secrets. So stay tuned, but the finish line is almost here and I need you to cross over so that together we can empower the next generation of girls and create a new narrative. So please keep voting for Akosia by dialing star 713 star 13 hash, follow the prompts or simply download the TV3 reality app from the Google Play Store or the Apple App Store. Kubi K4, Kwabra Gang, thank you. Medamasi. with hair by best and more limited ladies well groomed by african american beauty academy inspiring beauty beyond borders accessories by magdal kutu tourism and travel mean different things to different people the oti region ghana's hidden gem as i call it is a paradise for the avid nature adventure and cultural traveler one of the most important rules of travel is to connect with the locals. And the best way to do this is by joining a bus from Accra to Chinderi, Accra to Dambai, or Accra to Krachi. Seven out of ten times, you'll find yourself seated next to a personal tour guide. Someone who will be happy to walk you through the various towns that you are going to drive past on your way home, tell you some of the most beautiful stories of my region, and on a very good day, they may even invite you home to enjoy some of our staple foods, which include besaton nemonko, brown tea set with dried okra sauce, enjoyed by the people of Kokomba, or the local brown rice by the people of Lipe or Akpafu. This shows how hospitable my people are. My region is home to the Chabobo National Park, located in the Togo border. The park, you can climb the second highest mountain in Ghana, Mount Jabobo, which is about 876 meters high, and get a panoramic view of the region as well as the surrounding water bodies. My region, where the Chabobo National Park is, is also home to the African buffalo, the African bush elephant, the water bark, among other animals, including 500 species of butterflies and 235 birds. The tweeting and the chirping of the birds, coupled with the sounds of the flowing streams, can cancel out the noise in your head, help you to connect with nature and truly relax. Another place to visit is the Shiari Hanging Village. The village is a picturesque village perched on the hills, and the buildings are beautifully aligned in terraces. It is a true wonder to behold, and it's an indication and evidence of the intelligence of the indigenous man in architecture. Shiari is also home to the Shiari waterfalls, where you can draw a healing and relaxing bath. Another place to visit, in fact, a must visit in my region, is the Likwe Todome Ancestral Caves. A steep hike would lead you to six ancestral spectacular caves, which are believed to have been carved by our ancestors. It was handcuffed by them as an attempt to escape from their enemies and their wicked chief. So the term Likwe means carving of stone in Ebe. The umbrella rock in Jasikan, the ancestral caves, as well as the ancestral utensils made of stones, found in the Buen Jolu area, as well as the volcanic lake, the Etikwe River, which is a river that is covered by vegetation, and so it looks like a football park, and the monkey sanctuary in the Volta, in, sorry, in the Konya district, is also part of various undiscovered and unexplored tourism attraction sites in my region. There are significant opportunities for ecotourism health tourism, cultural tourism for investors. With the construction of the bridge over the River Oti, as well as other impending developments coming up in my region, the region is bound to open up over the next few years and would generate great returns on investment for the local tourism, domestic tourism, international tourism, as well as other businesses. And so let me conclude by saying that the Oti region is Ghana's hidden gem and your stay in Ghana would be an unforgettable one if you should tour the OT region. Thank you. Akosia from the OT region actually wrapped up before her time. All right, so moving on to the judges. Gigi, do I have your attention? Oh, you do. Uh -huh. Exactly. What would you say about her performance tonight? Once again, 
I, I keep say I come on this. Every single person who comes out, I think I I'm, I can speak for myself and not other judges. I look for how well you present and then sell your region. Once again, she gave us the flow. She educated me on a number of things in the region, region that I wasn't aware of. She was able to give flow. She was able to, um, Akosia, you're able to give us understanding. Mm. You were able to give us the various activities and segments that gives your region the ability to be followed through. Somebody would come to your region by listening to you. Well done. Thank you. Thank All you. right. Well done to you, Akosia. Moving on to Honorable Catherine Afeku. Akosia, you were very factual, and I liked that part of the presentation. Uh, when uh, a new person is coming to OT region, they want information, and you scored high points in my estimation on that. You were also very presentable, and you sounded excited about what you were presenting, and that goes back to my initial uh, presentation. If you are passionate about your region, that is how you get people to go there. Uh, you did a good job. Thank Passion you. to sell the nation. Please, a round of applause. Akosia from the OT region. Oh, please do it better for Akosia. Akosia, so this is phase two. Left with two questions. Do you want to pick one? Yes, please, please don't open it. Just pick it, and then you can give it back to me. Great. Let me drop the ball. Okay, are you ready? Yes, I am. Question says, the media is the sole contrib contributor to violent crime in the society. Do you agree or disagree to this statement? Give reasons for your answer. Thank you. Thank you for the question. I disagree to the statement that the media is the sole contributor to violent crimes in the society. My reason is that, yes, the media has a role to play, but it is not the sole contributor. Fictional television and films in, um, perpetrating violence have a way of contributing to short-term and long-term violence in, among the youth who watch them. And also the dissemination of information, if not done correctly, has a way of instigating violent crimes. However, the media is not the only or the sole contributor, considering the fact that there are other factors such as the nature-nurture. Nature being a person's personality, your temperament, etc., and then the nature being your socialization, the environment you're in, amongst others. It is actually, research shows that when a person is even intoxicated, it increases their chances of being violent. And so, no, I disagree. The media is not the sole contributor to violent crimes in society. Thank you. Akosia from the OT region, if she's your favorite this evening, make sure you keep her in the competition. Star 713, star 13, hash, add her name, Akosia. This evening is very crucial, so make sure that if she's your favorite, you keep her in the competition. Akosia, thank you very, very much.